student. It's going to be some studying, some cooking, commuting, productivity, etc. So if you guys like this video, be sure to like and don't forget to subscribe. And also go ahead and follow me on my Instagram. I post a lot of my stories there. And with that being said, let's get on with the video. Good morning. Spring break is finally over. I am going back to campus today. So before I head off to campus, I'm going to make myself a nice coffee. But you can probably hear the water boiling in the back. My last video also brought my bangs, how they were not sitting nicely, and now they're looking a little better. Please just ignore the hair during this. And I already have two exams this week. I thought my midterms would be the end, but I guess this is like a midterms 2.0. almost 8 40 in the morning i'm just gonna get ready and make myself some breakfast so that's what we're gonna do but first things first i'm going to brush out my hair and get ready <laughs> My favorite product to use lately on my hair is this Paw Paw It Does It All hair treatment. I got this for Christmas from one of my best friends and it really does a lot. It says it has heat protection, reduces split ends, detangler, leave-in hair treatment, reduces frizz, blow dry styling aid, and adds shine and it's vegan. And so far it's been working really well for me. <laughs> dry so I'm gonna go ahead and go through my hair with my Revlon hair dryer okay I am all done with that now I'm gonna just go in with my Trader Joe's shea butter and coconut oil hair serum which I really like but I never ever use a full plump because then I think it just gets too like oily 
That is literally all you need. You do not need any more than that. It's my palm. Kind of go through my hair. Yeah, and that's that. Now I'm just gonna do my makeup, which is just gonna be like concealer and mascara, and then get to school. Today is definitely a hoodie day. So before I get into all the specifics on my assignments and all that stuff, I got a comment on one of my videos asking to talk a little bit more about what I'm studying. So currently I'm a senior at university, so my major is marketing and my marketing concentration is in digital marketing and promotions, and I'm minoring in business data analytics. I think it's a pretty good mix of like design, creativity, science, and strategy very happy with what I chose to study. I'm graduating in December, so I have this semester and then next semester to go. So right now I'm in a finance class, a supply chain operations class. I'm in a content marketing class, in a global marketing class, a marketing analytics class, and also a business statistics class. So I'm taking like overload classes for this semester. I took five classes last semester and I had a lot of free time still, so I figured it might be a good idea to do six classes this semester so that my last semester of school be pretty easy i mean it'll still be five classes but you get the gist but yeah so basically what i have on my workload for the next few days is i have to finish up the marketing plan for my global marketing class the project is pretty much we have to take a company or create our own company have it be based to a target audience that is not the u.s and create a marketing plan that matches the different strategies of the other countries my group and I are working on a small space furniture company for Japan. So I have to finish up writing some stuff up for that. I also have two exams next week, so I'm just probably gonna take some notes and go through the slides and study for that. So yeah, let's get to work. super crazy but I just want to give a little bit of a realistic view on what it's like being a commuter student in university so if you like this video please be sure to leave a like and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next video